This breaking bond, a 22 year old who allegedly shot a man while trying to steal his catalytic converter is now a wanted fugitive after forfeiting his bond. Fox 26's Randy Wallace has the latest in his ongoing series. In August of 2020, this man, who we'll call Joe, caught these two men trying to steal his catalytic converter. While he tried to pull 21-year-old Jonathan Kipson from under his car, he spotted 22-year-old Ricky Joyner. He started shooting at me, and I started to return fire, and I was hit in the leg uh, almost immediately. Mr. Joyner gets charged with ag robbery with a deadly weapon. He's out on bond on electronic monitoring, and they issued a bond violation report all the way back in April of 2021. Even though Joyner forfeited his bond, 337th Criminal District Court Judge Colleen Guido reinstated it in 2021. Gibson, who also violated bond conditions, pled guilty into serving seven years in prison. Last November, Joyner once again failed to show up in court. He's now a wanted fugitive. This guy is dangerous. He's going to hurt somebody. He's already shot me over a catalytic converter and and now he's even more desperate because he's on the run. No one in the Harris County criminal justice system is keeping track of just how many defendants out on bond are now wanted fugitives. And these are very dangerous individuals. They've already thumbed their nose at the court. They've already said we're not going to comply with er anything. So what on earth makes you think they're going to comply with any of the laws of society? They just seem to think, well, when he pops up, we'll, we'll arrest him at that time. So nobody's avidly looking for him. And, and when he does pop up, it's going to be like the rest of your segments. Somebody's going to be on the other end of that kid and they're going to be dead. If you know Ricky Joyner's whereabouts, contact Crime Stoppers. You could get up to a $5,000 reward. Randy Wallace, Fox 26 News.